Hello Planeswalker, welcome to One Pack of Magic, where we open One Pack of Magic cards. And, well, with the events of the last few days being any indication, I might not be uh, opening as many Magic the Gathering cards. Um, you know, those who don't know, Hasbro has been like... Mm, devalued to the point of everyone saying sell off their stocks. Yeah, they kind of made some gains today because they sold off some properties, but um, I don't know. There no response to um, it's like, hey, you're killing your best product, and their response is basically whatever. Lol. Eh, kind of makes you not want to support the product. So it, you know, in the coming days, weeks, whatever, I will probably be. Shifting to supporting other games. I'll solo. I'll probably I can probably open some more Magic cards, you know, but not as much. Maybe even just some older sets. So, in any case, let's go back to Innistrad and see what happens when you decide not to have Till Death Do You Part. <laughs> Is a little information sheet about boosters, and we've got an art card of sisters. Olivia's attendance. Yeah, they yeah, yeah, kind of look like sisters. Uh, and we got the full art Victorian horror of the plains. We got doomed dissenter, one in a black. Human with 1-1, one, one, and when Doomed Dissenter dies, create a 2-2 two, two black zombie creature token. Dourgraf Scavenger. A 3 black zombie bear. A zombie bear. There we go. 2-3 uh, with Death Touch. And when Dourgraf Scavenger enters the battlefield, exile up to one target card from a library. If a creature card was exiled this way, each opponent loses two life, and you gain two life. That's pretty good. Siphon Essence. Two blue instant blood drainer. That's it. That's blood. I don't, I don't care which spell. Counter target creature or planeswalker spell. Create a blood token. Reminder. It's an artifact. It's an artifact. We'll pay one. Tap. Discard a card. Sacrifice this artifact. Draw a card. That's a lot of stuff to do. Just draw a card. Repository Scab. Three blue zombie. Three three. Exploit. When this creature enters a battlefield, you may sacrifice a creature. And when Repository Scab exploits a creature, return target instant or sorcery card from your graveyard to your hand. That's actually pretty good. Lunar Rejection. Ooh, that's pretty nasty. That's some body horror right there. One and a blue, or cleave for three and a blue. You may cast this spell for its cleave cost. If you do, remove the words in square brackets. So, if you do normal, it would be return target werewolf or werewolf creature to its owner's hand. If you cleave, return target creature to its owner's hand. Either way, you get to draw a card. Which is pretty damn sweet. Runebound Wolf. One red wolf. Two two. With three red tap, Runebound Wolf deals damage equal to the number of wolves or werewolves you control to target opponent. That is a lot of damage. Voltaic Visionary. One red human wizard with three one. And tap, Voltaic Visionary deals two damage to you. Exile the top card of your library. You may play this card this turn. Activate only the sorcery. When you play a card exiled with Voltaic Visionary, transform VV into Volt Charge Berserker. Ooh, I like that. 4 3 Berserker can't block. Guys, again, they're a Berserker. Alluring Suitor. This is the uh, showcase art. Two red vampire with two three. 
when you attack with exactly two creatures, transform Alluring Surger into Deadly Dancer. Oh dear. That's, uh, that's something going on there. Anyway. Still a vampire. 3-3 three, three with Trample. When this creature transforms into Deadly Dancer, add two red mana. Until end of turn, you don't lose this mana as steps and phases end. Pay two red mana, Deadly Dancer, and another target creature each get plus one plus, plus one plus zero until end of turn. That's not bad. Wedding Security. In the alternate, in the showcase art. Huh. This one is number 300, this one's 299. Uh, three black black, Vampire Soldier, 4-4. Four, four. Whenever, whenever Wedding Security attacks, you may sacrifice a blood token. If you do, put a 1-1 one, one counter on Wedding Security and draw a card. And our rare is... Yurth... Yurth... Great, I'm Daffy Duck. Yurth... Formit the Prophet. Let's try this again. Yurith, Tormented Prophet. One red, one blue-red, legendary human wizard, 2-4. If you would draw a card, exile the top two cards of your library instead. You may play those cards this turn. And we got a foil of Dreadlight Monstrosity. It is a four blue-blue crab horror. 5-5 five, five, with Ward 2. Reminder, whenever this creature becomes the target of a spell or ability and potent controls, counter it unless that player plays. Unless that player pays two. Player plays two. Same difference. Three blue blue, dreadlight monstrosity can't be blocked this turn. Activate only if you own a card in exile. And we got a token bug. Green insect, one one. As you do. Alright. I guess this would be the last rundown of what I would play. Um, oh, you really silly the foil with this thing. I tell you, this uh, setup upgrade really does, does the trick. I'm glad I uh, pitched out the ton box for it. Uh, yeah, I probably would. Uh, this would be good to do. You know, pitch cards, get cards. Let's team up with that one. But, um, uh, sure. Actually, I like that. When you attack with two, he changes and gains trample and then all sorts of fun stuff. So, yeah, I'd play that one. Um, yeah, that'd be cool. Especially with a 4-3 Berserker. Uh, if I were to build a wolf deck, yes. Um... Body horror, oof. Yeah, my, why not? Um, yeah, I can see myself playing that one. Uh, I don't know. I'm not a big fan of the blood token thing, so probably not. Um, Zombear with Death Touch. What, well, you know, what more can you say? Um, yeah, it'd be nice. I mean, you know, he dies and then you get a 2 2 creature instead, and the planes. So that was the set booster of Innistrad Crimson Bow. And like I said, I'm I'm you know, I feel like I should expand the channel. You know, just still open one pack of cards, except for special occasions, but do a bit more. You know, pres you know, put the spotlight on other card games, especially some that might you know, need it or other interests, you know, bring in more people to the channel. Bring in everyone. Speaking of bringing people in, if you made it this far, could you subscribe to the channel, please? You know, I you can't just, I got like 21 people. And be nice to have more people, you know, open more cards, have some fun. So, until then, I will see you tomorrow and have a magical day.